Well, we said earlier that Old Man Winter was overstaying his welcome. Yes. Uh, Allison, more snow on tap for uh, tonight and in the morning, right? Yeah, just a little bit, though. We're expecting just some light snowfall for tomorrow morning, but we are still expecting those roadways to stay slick overnight and into tomorrow morning as well, especially those areas that did see a lot of the snowfall earlier on this afternoon. Now, Pinpoint Doppler shows clearing and improving conditions, so good news for that. Two thumbs up for that. But we are still seeing just a little bit of snowfall over t just north of Breathitt County there, and we're going to continue to see just a slight chance of snowfall throughout the remainder of the morning. Also tracking a little bit of rain over towards Laurel County and over towards Knott County, but for the most part, things are starting to clear out over eastern Kentucky. So much, much welcome news, I'm sure, to everyone out there. 31 degrees over in Jackson right now. Calm winds, so we're actually feeling like 31 degrees, but tomorrow we're going to be factoring that wind chill and temperatures aren't going to really feel much cool, much warmer than the 30s. Now 31 over in Paintsville, 31 for West Liberty, 33 in Jackson, Hindman sitting at 31 degrees, 35 for Whitesburg. Temperatures mostly below freezing over towards the Big Sandy. Everywhere else still sitting above freezing. So any remaining precipitation we get likely going to be in the form of snowfall, especially towards those areas that did see a lot of that snow earlier on today. Now visibility going to be an issue in the morning as well. We're already starting to see some dense fog developing over towards Paintsville at two miles of visibility down to three over in Jackson and down to five in Wise. And we're sticking with a chance of fog throughout the remainder of the morning. But check out some of these snowfall totals. Morgan County saw around eight inches of snow. McGoffin seven, six and a half for Johnson County. Martin seeing five inches of snowfall. Now March's normal average in Breathitt County at least is around 2.9 inches. So we more than doubled our snowfall for the month of March in some areas. So lots of snow fell earlier today and you can see it just now pushing off towards the mid Atlantic. For the most part, Eastern Kentucky nice and dry, but we do still have a slight chance of some of that snowfall in the morning. And here's what I'm talking about. We're going to stick with a chance of scattered snow shower, but it is going to be light. So good news with that, but mainly over towards the Virginia state line there, especially areas that are in higher elevation like Pine Mountain, Black Mountain, areas like that. Now throughout the remainder of the afternoon, temperatures are going to warm up, but we do still stick with a chance of a slight chance of a shower tomorrow afternoon. Good news is, as we dry out by Saturday, but then later on Saturday afternoon into Saturday night, scattered rain shower is looking like a pretty good possibility. Also sticking with a chance of cloudy skies. So tonight roads are going to be very slick, especially in the northeastern counties who saw a lot of snow. Fog will develop and we do have an isolated chance of a snow shower. But the good news is temperatures are going to warm up to the mid 40s by tomorrow. Cloudy skies stick around throughout the entire day tomorrow though. But then starting on Saturday and Sunday, we do warm up into the 50s. And then you want to talk about a warm up 70 degrees on Tuesday. So spring making its return after this little spurt of winter that we had today. All right, Allison, thank you. Coming up next in